just not a oh poof magic here it is voila it's no it's, it's not like that hey y'all welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm talking about common manifestation and law of attraction mistakes that you must avoid overthinking when you are trying to manifest and use the law of attraction one thing you want to avoid is overthinking thinking about how will this happen what am i going to do to get it just being caught up in the how because once you start overthinking then you start not believing as much because you just see all of these things in your way first you need to decide that this is something that you truly want and this is something that you're going to go after and this is something you are going to get. The how doesn't matter. If you believe all those things that I just said, it doesn't matter how you're going to get there. You just know that you will get there. Don't focus on the how, but trust that it will be provided to you. Let's say you are trying to manifest some money and money randomly shows up to you one day and you're just like, how did this happen? Are you really going to be like that? No, you're going to invite that money in and you're going to say yes. Thank you. Oh, I manifested this. I don't know how this happened and I don't care, but I got me some more money in my pocket. Don't worry about the how. You're going to figure out the how. The universe, God is going to bring it into your life. You don't know what's going on behind the scenes and that is not for you to know. Just know that it will be yours. Focusing on what you don't want. A couple examples. I don't want to be in debt. I don't want to be in debt. It's like you're attracting debt because that's what you're thinking about. Even though you're saying I don't want it, but that's all you're thinking about is debt. I don't want to get kicked out of my apartment. Don't focus on that. If you are constantly thinking of what you don't want in your life, you are attracting that. So you want to avoid things that you don't want. Not taking action so manifestation and the law of attraction is not really like a you snap your fingers and things just automatically appear in front of you taking action for the things that you want for the things that you are manifesting because how is it going to come to you how can you be at the right place at the right time how can things come to you if you're not even showing up Manifestation and the law of attraction is more than just writing it down, more than just visualizing it. It's you have to do the work with that. I feel like some people just manifest and be like, oh, it's just going to appear to me. It's just not a, oh, poof, magic, here it is, voila. It's no, it's, it's not like that. And I believe that some people do think it's like that so they get really disappointed if that doesn't happen. You still have to take action for whatever it is that you're manifesting, you have to take that first step. Like, how is it going to get to you? How are you going to claim it? If it does work like that for some people, clap, clap for them. I think that is very rare. I took action while I was manifesting because I was saying, hey, I'm going to get this. I knew I couldn't just sit on the couch and watch Netflix or Hulu while I'm manifesting all of this stuff. It's like, how am I going to get this if I'm just chilling, you know? being desperate i feel like this is a common mistake where we're trying to manifest something and we are desperate we just get to that point where it's like this needs to happen i don't have any other options i don't know what to do time is running out like you don't want to feel like that it's a lot of pressure and it's a lot of anxiety and you don't want that when you are manifesting if you're to the point where you're desperate that is definitely a way to block your manifestations also when you're desperate you're just focused on not having it it's like oh i need this i don't have this how can i get this when you're desperate you have a victim mentality and you're focused on lack you're focused on that you don't have it you don't know what to do you feel helpless you feel weak and this is not a healthy way to manifest when you're feeling like this Another common mistake that people make when manifesting and using the law of attraction is giving up too soon. It's like you're not seeing any results. 
you're wondering why this isn't working for you, you're giving up on it, you don't believe anymore. And it's like, do not give up so soon. Just because it didn't work out this time does not mean it's gonna not work out next time. Sometimes you need to step away when you're not feeling so good and come back and try it again another time. But avoid giving up so soon if you don't see quick results in the beginning. Some things take time and just be patient before giving up. Not knowing what you want and why you want it. You want to focus on things that you truly want and have a desire for because manifesting is energy. Manifesting could be a lot and you want to put all of your focus on the main things that you want, the main things that would truly add value to your life. Well, that's the end of my video. If you enjoyed this video and you found value in it, hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video.